are we in search of the perfect human race? Yeah, I think we are. And I think you can see that from the literature, from the films, and also from the experiments that scientists are carrying out. The ethics straight away are maybe what will happen, as is happening already with, say, cosmetic surgery, that the rich will be perfect and everyone else will be the under-perfect. So instead of, like, at the moment, maybe it's by class in different ways or sometimes by skin colour, but in the future it will be those who've enhanced themselves and those who haven't, whether they're men, whether they're women, whether they're black, whether they're white. And I think there's this enormously important issue. To, so the racism would be how superior your body and mind is and how much you've been able to enhance your children and so forth. Okay. And in terms of movies like X-Men and Superman, how close are we to such forms of mutation? Well, I think they're extreme, but I think we're getting there. Most of the things that have happened um, in those films are already possible medically. Their procedures only carried out for medical purposes, um, but we are we are getting closer and closer. Yes. Scientists are already cloning um, human stem cells and animal stem cells. So just as we're, we're actually um, keeping farms with animals with human genes in them so that they can be used for transplantation purposes, it's possible to imagine a future we could do that. I don't think anybody's done it, but, you know, mm. seriously. Would you, as a parent, go and have some special teas added to your child before they're born? I, my answer for myself yes, for would be no, but if everyone around me was doing it, and so my child was going to be disadvantaged and I could do it, I don't think I'd stand out. That's my honest answer.